Hi everyone. My name is Chelsea Kraska and I am the Director of Religious Education at the Unitarian Church of Lincoln. Today we are going to be reading the story, We Are the Water Protectors. And this time, uh, usually at our church, this time of year, we do a ritual called Water Communion. And I have the feeling that many of you have been a part of this worship service before, where we each bring water from our homes or use the bowl with the big dipper in it at church and pour water into another bowl. And we have shared different things over the years. So I, I would like for your family to think about um, some of the ways that you have participated in the water communion at our church before, if you have done that. And if not, I'd like for you to think about, um, or in addition to that, I'd like for you to think about the ways that uh, you have used water or appreciated water over this last summer. And also just how you think that you can help keep our water clean and safe. So I'm going to share my screen to start. Um, doing our story. And let's see. Here we go. All right, we are water protectors. Written by Carol Lindstrom and illustrated by Michaela Goad. Water is the first medicine, Nokomis told me. We come from water. It nourished us inside our mother's body as it nourishes us here on Mother Earth. Water is sacred, she said. We stand with our song and our drums. We are still here. The river's rhythm runs through my veins, runs through my people's veins. My people talk of a black snake that will destroy the land. Spoil the water. Poison plants and animals wreck everything in its path. When my people first spoke of the black snake, they foretold that it wouldn't come for many, many years. Now the black snake is here. Its venom burns the land, courses through the water, making it unfit to drink. Take courage. I must keep the black snake away from my village's water. I must rally my people together to stand for the water, to stand for the land, to stand as one against the black snake. We stand with our songs and our drums. We are still here. It will not be easy. We fight for those who cannot fight for themselves, the winged ones, the crawling ones, the four-legged, the two-legged, the plants, trees, rivers, lakes, the earth. We are all related. Tears like waterfalls stream down, tracks down my face, tracks down my people's faces. Water has its own spirit, Nokomis told me. Water is alive. Water remembers our ancestors who came before us, she said. We stand with our songs and our drums. We are still here. We are stewards of the earth. Our spirits have not been broken. We are water protectors, we stand. The black snake is in for the fight of its life. And that is the end of our story. Thank you so much for joining me.